watching. Hi lovely people of YouTube, you look fine for Louis. Hi lovely people of YouTube, you look fine for Louis. You understand to Louis? Hi lovely people of our YouTube, you look funny with YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Good morning guys, just landed in London after another like, I think a seven and a bit hour flight from Doha. Oh. It's good to be back, it's good to be back in the UK. I just need to go and report my laptop that's lost with the uh, Qatar Airlines now. house and I've been chilling here for a little bit and I'm about to head straight back out again pretty much uh, up to London and I'm filming with Jamie Oliver for FoodTube which is his YouTube channel. We're going to be cooking something together. So I better drive to the train station. I'm horribly jet lagged and hopefully I can stay awake. where Jamie Oliver's offices are and it's already getting dark and then I just checked and the sun sets at quarter past four today. I've been out the country a month and the sun's now setting at quarter past four. That's not okay. That is not okay. Here we go. Hello fish man. Hi, it's Louis. Right, I've arrived at the Food Chief Studio. We're just getting ready over here. How's it going, Jamie? Hi, Louis. What are we what are we doing today? Uh, me, well, uh, my inspiration for you is Nando. Nando's. So, really uh, love Nando's. Yeah. So, how about beautiful chicken? Sorry. It's alright. <laughs> how about beautiful chicken? Well, legs and breast, uh, piri piri sauce, but fresh. Nice. Nice. A, a cheats. I know you like chili, so we're doing a cheats salsa that takes about 30 seconds. Okay. Okay. Um, and we're doing some sweet potato chips. Oh, amazing. Because I'm, I'm told yeah. that's what you like. I like, yeah. He knows everything I like. That's perfect. So I've got my mic set up. Look, look in the back pocket. Yeah. All professional. Look, here's the cameras. Nice. Nice. Oh, it's gonna be fun. It's gonna be fun. Right, we're starting. We're starting. We're just happy that you're here, bro. Jamie, cool. man, yeah. man, there's quite a few things for me to bring in. You're cool to just ask us to hand it in or pass it in. Yeah. 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 So, if you want to split your chicken, I've got now two cameras and two audio. <laughs> uh, if you want to split your chicken, go to that breastbone, big knife, and do one long move, and then bash it, and then all the way through, wow. and that is your half a chicken. Is that easy? Next stage, we're doing the time. This is the herb that we're getting ready for the marinade. What's, what, yeah, look, I'm talking what's, to you, but I know what we're doing. What's going to be quite interesting is like, we've got a whole crew here. Like we've got, uh, we've got, we've got, okay. we've got one, two, three cameras. Dude, what if yours looks better than mine? <laughs> You're going to be responsible for all these people getting fired. That's really rough, man. So somehow with one hand, you've got to massage the flavour into that chicken. Okay, I'm going to, I'm going to mix this marinade Deep. in now. We added some oil into the cuts. So, um, yeah, there's no polite way to do it. And if you cook that straight away, um, that um, would taste lovely. And if you let it marinate overnight, that is very good. Nice marinating. Louis, let me touch the screen to focus it. Yeah, I like your camera. Look at that, that's a really artistic shot. Right, we're doing the next bit. Okay, cool. We swapped in that so we'll for this straight one. straight in from that, and we'll kick off. Right, Jamie, show me the next bit. Yeah, it's exciting. Yeah, this is gonna be good. Ready? Yeah. Right, we're doing some sweet potato fries. Look at the way you shake that. 
Left-handed. Um, guys, <laughs> if you want to see this video from a different perspective, a different point of view, hit his camera now. Hit his camera now and see a better version of this video than you're watching right now. Pressure now on you. Yeah. Uh, right. That's semolina. And they used to make desserts out of that in the 1920s. Well, we're going to put it on sweet potato fries. So this is going to go super crispy. That has like a texture to it, yeah? Yeah, crunch. Right. Boom. We've just thrown the chicken and the sweet potato fries in the oven. How long do we need to put them in there for? Huh? Uh, we're going to put the chicken and the sweet potato in there for about 35 minutes, 30 minutes. All right. And how long was it on the griddle? About five, 10 minutes until charred. Come on, see if you can get in there. <laughs> now there's chili juice all over the place. Okay. The simplest cheats salsa ever in there. Brilliant colour, great flavour. Right, homemade peri peri sauce. Blending these roasted vegetables. So, with the chilies, I'm going to take the salt off. What we want to get out of a chilli is we want the heat, but if it's just mental heat, you'll never taste the fruit. Mm, mm. So what we do is we keep the chilli, but we try and lose the seeds, you know. But I love them. I mean, my favourite chilli actually is a scotch bonnet. Yeah, yeah, that's like, that's like the heat I like. I can't go So shall I add half to start with? Yeah. Because I'm a bit worried you're being a bit crazy. Chilli's added. Okay. A few other little spices and so stuff. We do, we do it from there. Lemon juice. Down, that can be our cup vinegar. We get, we'll get this it tastes so good. Man. How's it all going, Jamie? It's going really well. You're asking really good questions. Do you um, like the, the sauce still on my lens? Oh, yeah. A little bit there. Yeah. <laughs> it is. Sorry about that. Do you know, in, in um, chilies is a chemical called capsaicin, which okay. is the nearest natural form of morphine on the planet. Really? Um, so it releases. So that's the addictive thing. Um, very much so, yeah. um, but it immediately releases endorphins. So I don't know if you've ever eaten chilies quite quickly, and you have this whoosh, this kind of like, it kind of, whoa, yeah. and it kind of, you're yeah. rushing. Because it actually, a chili, eating a hot chili will have a, a faster effect than an espresso, if you want to pick me up in the morning. Oh really? Yeah, because like, oh, that's I don't know nice. in your life, but like in my life sometimes I've got to go and do a job, yeah. and um, I've got to be on the ball. Yeah, And like on my way here, I just got off the flight jet lagged. Fell asleep on the train, had to drink a Red Bull. Yeah, you can either do a load of coffee, but actually, if you just neck a load of chilli sauce or, or, or fresh chilli, it this picks you up. This is going to be a life-changing uh, tip for me. Look, like. listen, mate, when all my mates were going raving and dropping pills and doing all that filthy stuff, um, I just had a big chilli necklace, man. Yeah. It's like Lovell Serval. Guys. Right, people should try that at home. <laughs> I've been told that you've got a special relationship with coffee. Yeah. I have, that's uh, true. We've told a lot of stuff about you and food actually in the last 24 hours. So I thought what I'd do is try and get you to try coffee in a few ways you'd never had it before. All right. I'm and like mess with your taste buds yeah, and then see if you like it. I'm totally up for that. So um, I've made you a coffee granita because I know you love coffee. So basically this is it. It looks like snow. Um, and when, they, when, when you go skiing they always say don't ever eat brown snow or yellow snow. But yeah. I promise you this brown snow is very, very tasty. Right, let's give this a little taste. May I join? Wow. That is, that is incredible. Yeah, man. Oh, I'm a big fan. Smashing up the beans. So yeah, just smash up the coffee beans that you like. Professional. I know what the comments are gonna say. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, let's buy amazing cheese and let's kind of get good cheddar, but let's screw with everyone's concept of what's British or what's right or what's wrong. Yeah, this is so. This is already crazy. Okay, well if you don't believe, okay, you gotta try this because yeah, got it. Feed it to me. See, this is what I'm saying. What? Messing with people's heads. Guys, this is a cup of coffee. Affogato. With a uh, scoop of vanilla ice cream. It's better than Coke flame. What do you call it? Affogato? Yeah, man. Affogato. Like Listen to the sound, though. That's, that's the sound of pleasure. That's the sound of fun for Louis. <laughs> oh, hey. Chopping up that chicken. We'll go through the thigh and the drummer, like that. Are you hungry, Louis? I'm hungry. 
at this point, uh, you can just chop up some coriander, sprinkle it, sprinkle it around the story. Sprinkle it. Um, if you like lime, you know, I'm even making up my own words now. I like that. Um, sprinkle. Yeah, throw some fresh chilies on there. So we've got dry chilies in the paprika. We've got cooked chilies in the sauce. Do you ever chop your fingers when you do that? Never. Not since I was 14. Um, welcome to the real world. Fantastic. Of happy chicken, piri piri. Love, care, attention. Get that in your gob. Right, let's do it. That you love me. Let's do it. So, the moment of truth. Right, I'm gonna we have a bit of chicken in this salsa. Yeah. And then into the gob. Wow, this is fun, this vlogging thing. It tastes a lot of pressure. Like the flavours and stuff. Yeah. That's the only way I can describe it really. Is the chicken cooked alright? Perfect, like stuck to the edge, dipping off the boat. And you must be hungry after that journey home. Mm. So there we go guys. After aeroplane food. Chicken, two salsas, bit of the old slaw, crispy little sweet potato fries. Right, we're all done. It was an incredible meal. Thank you Jamie for You're more than having me. Wicked to do a collab with you, bro. If you guys want to see more of Jamie's videos, also when we when they finally put the one of this up, uh, go over to YouTube, subscribe. I'll link it below, like usual. Um, there's some incredible recipes, which I'm going to be watching quite a few of those videos. Thank you, mate. I think I've found like a new passion for cooking, I've never had before. So maybe, maybe you should check up on me and like see if I'm. Do you know what? I, do you know what I'd love to do is when you're traveling the world, just give you little briefs. Yeah. Like, the, the, those places you go to, I'm going to say, look, they're famous for that. Go right. find that thing. Okay. Would you do that for yeah, YouTube? Yeah. Yeah. A little challenge. It's wicked, man. That'd be little amazing. Little challenges whilst I'm traveling. Cool. Also, guys, the coffee recipes were on the Drinks Tube channel. Uh, where you can find out about some cool drinks and what else is drinks you about? Uh, well, it's everything wet really, yeah. smoothies, teas, coffees, but really it's all based around cocktails. Yeah. We love cocktails and we think like what cocktails so you guys do. like a drink? Yeah man, but like also like it's just amazing what a cocktail can do to a party, to a, a night, a dinner party. Um, so we've got some of the best mixologists in the world on FoodTube, at DrinksTube. Um, and um, it's wicked, a wicked little community of people um, that just like making wicked drinks. Sweet, so you can check that out as well. I'll link that below. Um, but yeah, it's been a pleasure, man. Thank you, thank you for coming. Cool. Straight off the plane. High five. That was an honor to be a part of that. That was cool, really cool. And I think Jamie's challenged me a bit as well with my eating habits and maybe he's a bit contagious with his passion for food. I think I'm gonna experiment and uh, try and cook a little bit more and sort out my diet and my eating ethics. Yeah. All right, I'm back with the fam. Here you go, Dad. Here's a present from Jamie oh, Oliver. Oh, look. Jamie, it's yeah, me. Ch oh. check the big book. Oh, look, it just says big love, mate. It's a, it's a pen, and he said, Um, you, we'll, you should come on the show next time. Well, guys, I definitely think it's bedtime. I pushed through as late as possible. I didn't quite manage to get my vlog up, I'm sorry, but first thing in the morning, I'll, I'll get on with that. Um, it's been a great day, even though I'm exhausted. Tomorrow, I'm shaving my beard, leaving the moustache for November. Um, I've had to wait until now because I was filming with Jamie and the project in China. But from now on, I'm just gonna be rocking the moustache for the rest of the month. And um, feel free to donate below. Movember's a great cause. I'll chat more about it tomorrow. But um, yeah, moustaches. Oh, right, night guys, catch you in the morning. Peace out, enjoy life live the adventure. Boom.